Hey yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to some more of that Ace of the Diamond Season 2 Episode 16. Last episode, hey, the spirit of Yuki took over my boy man Yuki, you feel me? Bro, I didn't know what was going on for a second. Like freaking Umumiya was casually having a conversation, talking about uh, you know, about being a challenger and all that stuff. And then next thing you know, freaking the calm before the storm. Boom, that boy Miyuki sent that thing, bro. Home run, baby. And yo, hey, I'm so proud of Miyuki, man. He is, he, like I said, I keep saying this. This whole tournament, he has been very consistent. And he, this game alone, he has really been stepping up. Like, hey, I like the fact that one, not only is he stepping up and looking good as a captain, but also the, the morale of the whole team has been boosted. You know, Zono is done with his stuff. You know, uh, Mochi's like, well, damn it, I'm glad we all good now, you know? And even the, the first years was seeing the rifts that was going on because Connie Maru and them were like looking like, bro, you know, but it was like, hey, but we all good. So I'm glad about that. Um, Footia, that boy, he, he looked like he'd been struggling. He has been struggling a little bit can't get on base uh they've been he's been walking people but towards the end of the episode hey he's looking good now which i guess this is kind of a trend because i'm um, pretty sure yeah footy really his 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 early game isn't normally the best anyway so it just it just took him a while to get warmed up but you know because again he's a man of few words we just kind of got to interpret how he's feeling by the look on his face <laughs> and the sweat dropping down on you know all that stuff but um yo so happy about all everything that's going on um hey ugumori hey y'all doing good too i ain't i ain't gonna, I ain't gonna doubt y'all but hey them boys at sato they playing on good good and also oh i do want to point out um there was one instance where y'all did clarify something for me um it was about uh uh who was it that hit it i forget i think it was shit was it, I, don't, I don't remember who it was but somebody hit the ball to right field and i was i was uh Y'all pretty much let me know that almost every time that's gonna they're probably gonna get on base or something like that. Um, blah 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 blah. Appreciate it. Uh, anyways, <laughs> we going we're about to get into this next episode. I'm looking forward to it. I think we in the seventh inning, fifth, sixth. I forget what inning we're in, but regardless, I feel like this game is coming to a close here soon. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop on into it. Wait, wait, wait. Is it about him getting on base? What he looking at his foot? Pitching so economically. Oh. <laughs> I thought he was about to say something else. <laughs> right. <laughs> Finally gets for a protagonist. <laughs> Yo, that's crazy. <laughs> Let's go. Bottom of the seventh. We up the bat. Told you! Send that thing! You ain't got the bunnies. You ain't got them bunnies. You ain't got them bunnies. You ain't got them bunnies. Okay. Yes, got the second, my boy. Yes, sir. Okay, Tojo. Woo! <laughs> okay, you recognize greatness from your uppers. Time to step up. Time to step up. Time to step up. Send that thing. Send that thing, my boy. Send that thing, my boy. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Yes, sir. Okay, Tojo with the run. Hagasa with the hitch. Okay. Zono got home too. Yes, sir. Yeah. <laughs> we looking good. <laughs> what? Dang. Yeah, this might be. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Um, you laughing? What? <laughs> oh, they, bro, I love this team. They down, but they ain't out. You feel me? They like, bro, we gonna keep the fight alive, baby. This, the, I like that attitude. Everybody's like, what the fuck is going on here? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The crowd at they back. I like that. I like that. Ah. He's like, give up. <laughs> Y'all must have thought about giving up. <laughs> I didn't think about giving up. We ain't thought about giving up. Oh. 
Okay, okay, okay. I'm... Yes, sir, bro. I'm rooting for them too. God damn it. We looking good out there, both teams. Yes, sir. Uh -oh. All right. What is wrong with his foot? This is the second time they've showed his foot this episode. What is wrong with his foot? Mm. <laughs> I mean, Coach Katoa could like it, but I'm a little worried now. Yeah, I feel like I think I know what's about to happen here. I think this this inning right here, we about to we about to we about to see him. Something bad's about to happen. Mm. Okay. Mm, hit him in the ego. Mm, they about to get aggressive. All right. That boy. Let's go, my boy. Mm, okay, okay. Really? 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 So he's not going for the fastball. Right, right. Okay, okay. He got it. He got his eyes on it. Got his eyes on it. Oh, right, because this team is nasty when they got a runner on base because they love to steal. Yeah, he ain't swinging no more. Right, right. Hey, now, Kun, he's a good coach. I feel like he about to send this thing. Mm, years of hard training for a battle settled in a moment. Bro, I love these, these, these phrases, these... Hmm. <laughs> uh oh first one on the field oh he ain't got no life in his eyes so he wasn't always wheelchair bound oh my gosh why do they keep doing this to great players man mm. Right, him saying that even though he wheelchair bound. He, he's hurting inside. Exactly. Behind closed doors, he's probably. Bro. It's just not fair, man. He just keep. <sighs> This is why Umumiya said what he said about giving up. Because the fact that freaking Naokun hasn't given up, even though he wheelchair bound, he can't play on the field no more. Oh my God, he fighting for his dream as well. Bro, man. That's why they have so much fun. They ain't gonna allow themselves to be upset about losing because they fucking fight for him, man. Bro, Umumiya send that thing out the fucking field. Right, right. Accept your position. You know what you did, but you came back. Ah! Let's go. <laughs> Sit that thing. Sit that thing. Come on. Yeah, yeah, that thing gone. That thing gone. That thing gone. Y'all ain't catching it. I love this show, man. God damn it. The stuff, man. Bro. I love this team. I love these players, bro. I love the heart that everybody got, man. Bro. Like, it's, it, why do you think they fucking got the whole crowd behind them? Because they don't got time to be dwelling on, oh, we down by some runs, bro. We got a teammate here who fucking, who ain't never gave up, and so we ain't giving up. And I'm fucking switched up. I ain't even freaking root for Sato no more for real. <laughs> like, I want him to win, but obviously, bro. Ugu Mori done pushed me all in the heart. 
<laughs> yes, sir. Sorry, Haruichi. You ain't getting that, my boy. You ain't getting that, my boy. Sorry, should I sue? You ain't getting him out, my boy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Bro, nah, they about to close that gap real quick. Bro, okay, bowl cut, bro. What? Oh my gosh. Bro, we ain't gonna show you no weaknesses, my boy. Well, we might, but listen here. We still about to get this dub, but they ain't learned nothing, man. You keep already getting ready to start. Bro, they hitting everything, bro. What the? Oh, what the? Well, damn. <laughs> Good thing you had a helmet on. <laughs> Yo. Yo. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. They did. Oh, he gonna hit that first pitch regardless. Because <laughs> they swinging at that thing. Oh, God, they hit me with another flashback. Mm. Ah, yes, sir. A simple difference made baseball so much fun. Yeah, doing it because you want it to, my boy. Yes, yeah, sir. Hey, hey, Ugo Mori looking good. I'm sorry, Mochi, my boy. I'm sorry, but he about to be safe. He about to... He about to be safe. I'm sorry. Oh my God, bro. I mean, who, why would they be? Ugumori showing out right now. Shoot. Like to close the gap, this, that, it was three to eight when the episode started. Now it's what? Six to eight now? Four, uh, seven to eight? Something like that? <laughs> bro. I can just seeing how great he is as a manager. I can only imagine that. Damn, that's the episode. But I can only imagine how good of a baseball player he was because even Umumiya even said like Naokun was the one of the few players he was he couldn't beat. So yes, it was unfortunate that he got in that accident. And of they didn't they didn't say it per se, but it's clearly they they didn't have to. It, it seemed like the accident, it was a permanent thing. And so he's looks like he's forever wheelchair bound. But I just I like the fact that they 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 showed us the fact that he want like he's like this strong individual. But it's like ain't nobody putting that much effort towards something that they can't play no more and then it and it don't eat them up inside. So I'm glad they they actually showed the fact that when he got the information initially yeah it punched him it beat him down and when mia saw that and oh my gosh and it's just it's just it it just shows just how much every single player on ugumori how much respect they have for naokun because umumia had already left baseball he wasn't playing no more but when he heard about the news and and that that brought him back to baseball all because one his dream freaking Naku's dream is to go to go to nationals you know and he's like okay you know what he physically he can't he can't do it on the field no more so i want to help him towards that dream and every single person on that team wants to help him towards that dream and that's why they don't get upset when they down some runs because they they i know they don't think of it this way they might think of it this way but it they if with my interpretation it would be disrespectful to Naokun if they would have get, given up when they were three down three to eight. It would have been disrespectful because he's he's done so much for them. And for them to give up before the game is still, before the, before the ninth inning struck would have been disrespectful. It's been in the face. So I like the fact that they, they laugh, they have fun. They keep fighting and rooting on each other all the way into the end. Like that is dope, man. And they've accomplished a lot. I mean, they bodied in a Shiro. That alone was was a big accomplishment. And to be putting Sato in a corner like this, like, yo, Ugumori is not a bad team. They are a a scary team, actually. And so I I I like I like this team. Yeah, I'm worried for Sato, obviously, but you probably couldn't tell from this whole video because I definitely was rooting strongly for Ugumori. <laughs> but listen. 
obviously, I always want the home t the home team to win. But listen, Ugo Mori keeps showing out, my boy. But uh, Footia, I know Coach is letting him pitch this eighth inning or whatever. But Footia was over there hoping he was gonna pitch the ninth inning. But I see kind of what the trend, what this this trend that's going on. This is the the longest he's pitched. They said so far, so eight innings, and so. Even though he hasn't got to that ninth inning yet, I feel like he, at some point he's going to pitch a full game. But I don't think it's going to be this game. I think with how how many runs they just got off him, the fact that they done switched up their entire their their, their batting strategy, Umumiya is doing the opposite of what everybody else is doing. Because initially he was swinging at the at the the splitters and whatever and the, the pretty much the low pitches, but now he's not. And uh, everybody else, they they aggressive. They swinging off the first pitch. So they going to have to, just like Ugo Mori switched up the batting strategy, we're going to have to switch up that pitching strategy. Coach Kutoa could make the call, my boy Footy. You're going to have to just be in your feelings for a little bit because you, you about to go sit on that bench. <laughs> but uh, nonetheless, fire episode. I'm looking forward to the next one. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace.